these threats are flying farther, faster, and with more accuracy, and it can attack from 360 degrees. Adversaries are now coordinating attacks to use these threats simultaneously. LTAMS is a 360 degree radar that will replace the current Patriot sectored radar. It will be used to detect and track an evolving set of threats to include ballistic missiles, cruise missiles, aircraft, unmanned aerial systems, First of all, it's 360 degrees, sensing and detecting threats from every direction, and it's powered by gallium nitride, a powerful semiconductor technology that strengthens the radar signal and enhances its sensitivity for longer range, higher precision and resolution, increasing the capacity and reliability of the radar system. If they so desire, they can ask uh, that we integrate Patriot with the LTAMS sensor. LTAMS is compatible with the current Patriot interceptors, the PAC-2 GEM-T and the PAC-3 MSE interceptors. And it is also capable of supporting future interceptors, both kinetic and directed energy It's just been over two years since the contract award. And in April of this year, the first radar arrived at White Sands uh, Missile Range, uh, the Army's uh, testing site. Five other radars are advancing through various stages of development and test. We have two at our open air test site in New England. And then the remaining three are in our Andover factory completing integration test. Just last month, the Minister of Defense in Poland signed a letter of request to the U.S. government requesting LTAMs as part of their air defense uh, architecture, making a significant step to becoming one of the first international customers. International expansion not only brings this exceptional capability to our allies, it enables them to deter and defend against current emerging threats, but the commonality with the United States extends our strong working partnerships and also affords cost benefits by having the same system. Just like the 18 partners of, of Patriot today, we foresee a similar program where they all participate in a partnership of support. Uh, we have uh, what's called the International Engineering Support Program, and that essentially shares the cost of upgrades of the system across all of the participants of the program. It's what we call a software-defined aperture, meaning the system can employ additional capabilities through uh, software upgrades. This will significantly expedite getting new capability to the warfighter uh, in equipment that they're already operating. The other benefits of our Ghost Eye uh, technology is the level of automation to emplace, operate, and maintain these systems as compared to current radars. They're all digital, you know, that means there's no single points of failure. And there's also an AI-based system health uh, prognostics capability built in. These features translate to a much higher operational availability of the system and lowers the manning requirement, making it much more economical for our customers to operate.